Welcome to another week, another episode of Fictitious Facts Friday. What is the fan fiction we talk about today? The fan fiction we are talking about today is Valor and Valor Cup. And what should we do with this uh, problem, apparently? From many, many players within the community, one of their pet peeves in this expansion. Because, because let's be honest, it's not a massive game-breaking problem, right? Even if you have an issue with Valor points, we are definitely not in the same situation as we were three-ish months at the start of Shadowlands, right? Players with problems like remove the restriction of covenants, allow us to respect different covenants. What about the more? Why are we still forced to do the more for just a measly socket? Why are we getting shards of domination in 9.1? That feels awful. What about the energy for our conduits? Why is that still there? Okay, it's nothing that bad. It's nothing nearly as as awful to play, but it is still somewhat of an annoyance for many players. Now, one side of the argument is very simple. I want to be able to spam Mythic Plus. The removal of Valor is just going to give more incentive for players to just play more. Blizzard is literally losing subscribers, losing players by, by telling them, no, you should play less if they keep the Valor cap. Why wouldn't they just want to remove this cap so more players are incentivized to play more inside of Mythic Plus. Another side, the more conservative side, is saying you can't uncap Valor because that is just going to encourage the generate play and it's going to also completely break the ecosystem of Mythic Plus where the players with tons of time will find themselves at full 415 item level one week or even two weeks into the season, while players who did not have time to play nearly as much will be left behind at 395 or 400 item level because they did not have the time to farm Valor. So that would be not fair. Also, there are players who care more about raiding who would be saying that is not fair for raiders, right? The first week of the season, you will be trying to progress through Heroic, giving you 402 or 405 item level while players can just spam mythic plus and upgrade all of their gear to 415 that would also instantly make heroic raiding completely worthless now aizen aizen are you a fence sitter do you even have a strong opinion on this or are you just going to be here not really leaning on either side well my side, what would seem like a fence sitter, but actually it's more on the side of limiting the Valor acquisition while still trying to get players into Mythic Plus. For example, one cool solution to this issue could be allowing players to farm Valor, but for example, splitting the currencies. You could have one type of Valor which could stop the upgrades at 405 item level, for example, and then the higher tier of Valor, which can only be obtained in keys higher than, you know, plus 10 or higher than plus 15, and that is the type of currency you would have to use to upgrade the piece of gear all the way up to plus 15. So you would give players full full reign on being able to spam Mythic Plus, to spam Mythic Plus for Valor all the way up to 405, but then if they want to get the second type of currency, that would be gated, that would be limited. You can still upgrade tons of gear, but stop at 405. Then once you reach 405, you have to have the, the, the weekly gated system that we currently have. That could try to make both sides happy. It could try to get still players to be into, to participate in Mythic Plus without having to, you know, massively overgear players who are raiding. Another problem I find with Valor is that at the end of the day, even though you don't care, okay, there are many players who don't, even though you don't care about raiding, you still have to gear up at the very least as long as raid gear and mythic plus gear coexist at the same time so they, they, they don't function like pvp gear for example as long as they coexist you still have to power up one side at an even level to the other so you cannot uncap mythic plus gear without giving anything to the raid loot because if you do, of course, the raid loot would become much, much, much too weak. 
You could, for example, if you wanted to uncap Valor, you could bring back Dinars from the Season 4 of Shadowlands. You could bring back deterministic ways for raiders to get their gear. You could bring back also some type of tokens. Valor, similar, like tokens that you could then earn in the raid to purchase items. Some type of way to increase, to speed up the acquisition of gear from the raid so that it would be somewhat on a similar level to Mythic Plus. My best solution when I was thinking about this as I was in the bathroom was to simply split Mythic Plus and basically split the acquisition of this resource, of this currency in different type of keys because also we all know what is going to happen if you uncap Valor. Players are going to play and do high keys just enough to get the rating that is going to unlock the upgrades and then they're going to go all the way back down to spamming plus five burial ground keys or plus four court of stars keys right they're going to get themselves decked in 415 gear doing mostly plus five dungeons for valor points and that's not fine that is not fair i think the simplest way to prevent this type of abuse is to divide the currencies and make a certain currency drop at 15 plus or maybe even i'll tell you this even increase the item level rewards of mythic plus upgrading all the way up to 418 no longer 415 but make that valor make that type of currency only drop from 20 keys and higher so it doesn't really matter if you spam plus five boiler ground keys what you need once you get your gear at 415 is 20 plus keys this would try to limit the amount of endless spamming of super low keys. So you can keep your Valor uncapped, you can have no limit in how much you can grind, but it is going to be limited in brackets. So that at a certain point, once you have upgraded all of your gear, you will have to start doing higher and higher dungeons for being able, for being allowed to upgrade that particular piece of gear. And even with that, even with that possible solution, we would still need some kind of solution for the raid. Because as I said, you cannot improve, you cannot upgrade the acquisition of gear from Mythic Plus at such an exorbitant level. The level of Valor is uncapped. You can literally play 24 hours a day and get yourself to 415 item level without going hand in hand with the acquisition of gear from the raid. That is perhaps still the biggest cock block as far as Mythic Plus is concerned. It's, it's logical, right? You love Mythic Plus. You, if you could, could play, would play Mythic Plus for several hours a day. The problem is that as you play Mythic Plus for several hours a day, you want a reward. And of course, the most logical reward in Mythic Plus is going to be gear. Or if it's not gear, a currency which allows you to upgrade gear you already have. Unfortunately, the raid does not have the same system. Unfortunately, you go into the raid, you kill the eight bosses of Vault of the Incarnates, you loot zero items, your master looter raid leader gives you zero items, you are done for the week. That, in comparison to Mythic Plus, in comparison to uncapped Valor Mythic Plus, would be a tragedy, would be a disaster. You would find easily players who just cleared all of heroic Vault of the Incarnates at 400 item level and then someone who spammed Mythic Plus with uncapped Valor at 412 item level very very easily and that that simply cannot happen it would not be balanced that is the biggest issue we currently have towards the requests of uncapping Valor for Mythic Plus the fact that we need to still find a way to go hand in hand and to give rewards hand in hand between raiding and doing Mythic Plus. I doubt, I doubt Blizzard will ever move at the very least in the near future towards uncapping Mythic Plus. So I believe the, the closest thing you can do is trying to push for the more lax amount of weekly valor that is allowed to be earned. That is perhaps much, much more likely to happen, something that Blizzard would be much more likely to cave in to the community requests of allowing you, for example, to get a thousand valor instead of 750, maybe 1250 valor instead of 750, maybe even 1500, twice as much valor 
instead of 750. That is something that would likely be more valuable. Even something like a, a you know valor item disenchanter. You can scrap a piece of item that you have upgraded with valor and gain back you know 80% of the valor you have consumed on that item, 70%, 60%, any amount, so that you so that you would not feel that bad in finding an upgrade that would replace a valor piece and you know feeling bad about losing all those hundreds if not thousands of valor points you had to spend on that item that could also be a way to make your valor upgrades more meaningful by being able to shift around the valor points after you have disenchanted the item that could also be a thing for for valor upgrades however at the moment i feel like any ideas towards uncapping valor is just a moot point that is not going to happen and it's not that it's not going to happen because i think it's wrong it's not going to happen because i think it's dull to to allow you to get infinite valor in mythic plus by itself i think at the moment even on blizzard's point of view it is wrong simply because mythic plus has to go on the same rails right on the same path as raiding and allowing you to upgrade items without a cap to valor would be nearly the same equivalent of not having a lockout and having resettable mythic bosses in the raid that would be almost the same level of gear power that the raid would have and that of course is never going to happen in the raid so this uncapping valor thing i don't think it's going to happen and i don't think it's going to be a good way to request improvements for mythic plus i think we have to we have to settle for something else some other kind of requirements other kinds of requests when talking about improving the loot improving the rewards from mythic plus starting from as i said simply earning more valor every week that would be a start so this was the entire rant of fictitious facts friday talking about the possible improvements and possible changes happening to the valor acquisition the valor cap every week and also why it's very unlikely and it would be generally speaking very unfair if valor acquisition would be uncapped every week unfair towards players in the raid mostly so with this completely unneeded point we are done for today on this friday as my voice is quickly going away it's time to say our goodbyes for the start of this weekend we are thanking of course first all of my patreon supporters as usual for the contribution and the help to the growth of this channel you can still support in other ways that are instead free liking and commenting down below as well as subscribing to the channel itself are good ways to stick it up to the youtube algorithm other ways to show your support would be to follow me over on twitter as well as following me on my stream over on twitch now with these social pleasantries done with we are leaving each other thank you guys again for watching see you guys tomorrow and in the meantime why has it gotten so bad what's happening to the voice again god damn it <laughs>